guys, what's up? In this video, I am so freaking excited about Webflow's new AI builder. Honestly, it's doing such a freaking mind blowing job. And let's have a look at it. So first of all, obviously check out this landing page and how beautifully it is done. So I'm gonna scroll to the bottom. It's gonna basically create a prompt. I'm gonna scroll down. It's saying you can actually choose a style. You can go ahead and choose a theme. You can go ahead and actually do a bunch of stuff, pick, uh, headings pick like again the typography pick, pick colors and all of that stuff let's just go back and actually try the AI site builder ourselves I'm gonna add the link to this particular thing directly in the description or the comments of this video so you can directly go ahead and play around with it so let's go ahead and say AI site builder okay so now we are here but I don't necessarily want to generate something really common uh, that it would have templates for why don't I generate a business for something unique like let's say it's rocket fuel and what does the business do it provides um, my business provides rocket fuel to missions going to Mars and Pluto or something along those lines it also helps fix broken rockets and space shuttles and also helps with alien communication i don't know let's go ahead and actually see what we have with just that i'm just going to choose the brand style that's like ai suggested i'm going to say i want a dark theme and what do i want since this is professional i actually want it executive or it can even be insightful as well let's just go ahead and do that and click on generate and see what we actually get Okay, so looks like it's generating out a website here and it's pretty much done. So let's see what it actually generates and if this is something impressive. So let's give it a few minutes as well. So we have fueling the future of space exploration. I like, I, I'm not, I don't, I'm not going to say I like the font, but I can see it definitely does talk about a lot of amazing stuff. Advanced fuel for interplanetary missions, rocket repairs alien communication sounds pretty amazing okay we have this stuff we have the team we have a footer i mean i'm gonna say that it did a pretty good job let's just go back to the top so as you can see at the top we can actually choose our theme choosing the theme actually changes the design quite a lot so you can actually click on generate more and it's going to give you some other suggestions as well for the theme so you can actually have a look at that i actually liked the previous darker one so let's just go to the dark one. It's going to change the font. It's going to change the colors. It's even going to change some of the images that are used. I think, no, it didn't change the images, but we can do that ourselves. So once you're done with that, you can actually go to the colors to choose the colors as well. Maybe I actually want it like purplish like this, or maybe I want it like this. This actually looks much better. Let's just go ahead and do that. Or maybe I actually want purple. Those who know me know how much I actually like purple. So here we have something purple. That's amazing. Let's go to the images and choose some image examples. Um, maybe let's go pitch black for the images. So let's just do that. And as you can see, it's going to start updating all of the images on the page to actually sh give me something pitch black. Okay, I mean, it is what it is. It was working for the most part uh, pretty well, but I am not sure why it actually didn't. So we can actually go back as well. We can go ahead and do some modifications as well. We have a bunch of other variations as well. So we can swap styles. We have a bunch of layouts as well. It's not going bad. It's actually suggesting me some layouts as well. And I can try these layouts uh, on the hero section. Very similarly, if I go down for this particular section, I can try a bunch of other layouts for this particular section as well. I can go to the buttons and I can even go ahead and actually choose what type of buttons like I really like these buttons by default but just in case you're wondering you have a bunch of these different styles of buttons let's go ahead with something dark as that we have the card design as well we have the roundness as well and all of that stuff is basically just here let's go ahead and say that I'm ready to start building so once you do that I just want to mention that you can change all of these things that we just talked about in the theme section on the left so that's going to be available for you Let's also go ahead and actually check out the variables that it has generated. I mean, just check out the quality and the level of depth it has gone into the variables. I mean, it's pretty amazing stuff, honestly. Very similarly, if we go out and have a look at the CSS styles that is it has generated, these seem pretty readable and pretty nice as well. So it's amazing stuff. 
Now, for example, if I want to create a separate page, I can just go ahead and do that. I can even go ahead and actually design a layout with AI. So I want to add a section here. What should the section be? I can go ahead and as you can see on the right, we have an AI assistant basically asking us, what do we want to generate? Do I want to generate a pricing section? Sure. Let's go ahead and actually generate a pricing section. I say pricing and now it's going to generate these pricing sections. Now you may think these pricing sections don't really look like the site that we just designed. This is pretty bad, but let's have a look at what happens when we actually click on it. Is it going to generate the exact thing or is it going to actually go ahead and match the style that we have? And as you can probably expect, it's going to go ahead and do that as well. So let's move our pricing section here. We can again go on the section. We can even ask it to do a bunch of other things as well. But let's just go ahead and actually that's sufficient for now. Very similarly, if I let's say want to go ahead and actually generate a new page, I can just go here and I can say generate a new page with AI and I want to generate, let's say, blog post or a blog page. I don't know why I actually said a blog post. Let's just go ahead and cancel that because a blog post is, post is usually a very simple page. page. Let's just go ahead and actually generate a blog page. So let's see what it actually does and how good of a page that it actually generates. Is it pretty simple, straightforward stuff? So again, we see a bunch of errors could not save your site. Please check your connection, all of that stuff, but that shouldn't be an issue. So we have this page now. We can actually see what the full page looks like. So it looks like this. Check out these freaking scroll animations that are happening on scroll. Is this insane or what? So I mean, it is doing a pretty amazing job at it. Now, obviously we can go to each sections and actually play around with it and do things ourselves. And I mean, pretty amazing stuff, honestly. We have this AI button as well to design with AI. Start by adding a new section. So obviously, if you wanted to add a section yourself, you can do that as well. So again, pretty amazing stuff. I'm pretty excited for the future. Obviously, it's going to reduce our role in the initiation process. But I feel like we have a huge role in the creative one. Though how long that actually remains is a pretty questionable thing. That's pretty much it. Do subscribe, hit the bell icon. I'll see you later. Take care. Bye.